it's Christmas tomorrow, tomorrow, but we thought we'd do something that's not very Christmassy, but still celebratory and fun. So for all of you... In some parts of the world, it's Christmas, of Christmas tomorrow, but uh, it's Christmas in two days in the UK. But uh, yeah, true. stay or tuned whatever. for some different material. We start with for David and Sue, and this is dedicated. This to is Zena. dedicated to Zena in Tasmania, who has just his grand their granddaughter, who has just passed her uh, f- her first guitar exam. Ninety eight percent. Well done. Well done, Zena. So, your grandfather has requested the Darktown Strutters Ball from nineteen seventeen to celebrate. And we were just saying, I wonder how many people would pass a first day guitar exam and get this in reward. It's unusual. These days. These days. Only on living room request. <laughs>
Matt plays a guitar and that he keeps the the, very pleasant. Love it. He supplies his own accolade. You know what I was saying yeah. about the the, the way that I we played it. it. It's so pleasant compared to, you know, obviously in jazz when people have played the song, you know, oh, well, we maybe 50,000 times. There's, there's there's a lot of, it lacks pleasantry. He has a lot of gigs. He has a lot of gigs where he's just going strum, strum, it strum, strum, strum. Moderato, and he gets it says on the sheet music moderato. And to me, oh. that was moderato. No, I was going to say, I like the way that Matt plays guitar in that he, he plays the bass notes and he plays the chords. And I've worked with guitarists who um, will sort of leave out the bass entirely, <laughs> thinking that there's an imaginary bass player in the Very corner. In jazz. Um, so yeah, there's a lot to be said about that composition, but it was composed in the mid 1910s. Yeah. Uh, and published in the latter think. 1910s. And uh, well, don't close it just yet. I just want to say something. Um, yeah, I think one of those typical things in jazz, um, another one from a similar era, a couple of years later, it's called um, The World is Waiting for the Sunrise. Mm -hmm. And because there's not a lot of harmony in the chorus, people tend to play it really fast when they improvise on it because it's almost implied like later compositions, like, uh, can't think of any examples off the top of my head, but later compositions, when you get More less complex. harmony, no, less harmony, oh, right. it usually means the tempo is faster. I mean, you get that in oh, rock, see, rock see, music. If it's, da, 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 yes. it's not much harmony. It's not yeah. a different chord every beat. So that's why people will... They just default to that. Because they don't know what to fill it with. They've lost well, that. It, it, to, to, to people, it implies that it's faster. Anyway, more on that another time. Thanks <laughs> for the very much for the suggestion. Thanks very much for the yes. request. Oh, yes. David and Sue. David, marvellous. Um, I think David and Sue heard me when I was on Woman's Hour and then got in touch and then started following. And um, it's possible. It's wonderful. Now, we're going to go... Uh, Paul has requested... Not my husband, Paul, but Paul, <laughs> Paul who re requests... Paul from Halifax... Um, has requested a number from Iolanthe. And I've got this, the peer and the peri. Oh my goodness, the plot. Uh, we've got a, a, a young man who is half fairy, half human. And we've got uh, the, the Lord Chancellor. It's, it's quite a plot. It's quite he's a plot. The, he's the son of Iolanthe, right? What I love about this copy is that it's got, it's got with pen and ink, somebody's put the names of all the actual people who have played these roles in this particular production that this, that this copy was for. And it says, it's just a wonderful cross section of the types of names that were around in the 1910s, I'd imagine, don't you think? Stan. It's hard to tell. It looks, it, it, it looks like, could be 1930s, right? You reckon? Yeah. Well, the Lord Chancellor has been circled. and it's Stan's just, copy. So I think it's got. Stan's copy, but I, Jack, Dick, Stan, Ted, Eric, Gwen, Gwen. Mary, Sally, May, Frida, and Joy. I mean, the names, the names of the time. Comment now, below if you can guess what decade that, that, that this was used. I don't know. Right, this is let's a do it. Piece of, this is very interesting. I've never used Which this. Which number are we doing, Patricia? Ooh, we've got a bit of dialogue on a, on a, on a typewriter in there. We are doing Recit and Ballad. Um... Iolanthe herself is pleading for the, um, the the life of her son. Well, and also that he should have whom he 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 loves. It's it's believe me the plot. If I if I gave it to you now, we'd be here forever. Um, so just look it up. Um, Recit and ballad. at your feet I kneel Oh, listen to a mother's fond appeal Hear me tonight I come in urgent need Tis for my son young Strephon Plead. He loves, if in the bygone years thine eyes have ever shed tears, bitter unavailing tears flow. 
boy, he dies. He dies if fondly laid aside in some old cabinet. Memorials of thy long dead bride lie dearly treasured yet. Then let her hallowed bridal dress Sullivan. Lots in there. I was just wondering, there must be, I wonder, is there a Gilbert and Sul Sullivan Society in Tasmania? That's what I'd love to know. I was wondering, know. is there a Gilbert and Sullivan Society which is just solo guitar? Oops. Ooh, now that would be something. A company, but that's it. That's that's all you get. Well, he's played two guitars thus far of different, different types. And we now had... I'm going to play mandolin. And we're going to do a differing type of song yet again because it's Living Room Request. Where you choose. You do. What it is, and we do it. For £40. That's it. And you can just click the link in this description or go to patriciahammond.com forward slash request. There's a whole a bunch whole of other things. There's a whole list of over there. 500, must be creeping towards 600 songs now. And you can buy t shirts that Patricia has designed. <laughs> Like to a real YouTuber. Book. To go with my book. It's more so that I can say I have. I should wear them. Tell people about this song. Uh, this is Roulette. A song by a, a band called System of a Down. Um, which is kind of a very interesting band, actually. Um, people are watching thinking, but not that Roulette by that System of a Down. But yes. <laughs> I'm sure there's a song called Roulette. Anyway, Liz ever Liz has, has has actually I've said this before because it is true of all the requesters Liz who lives in Austria mm. has requested a wide variety of things yes, she really has. the widest variety going from Purcell all the way up to Red Hot Chili Peppers <laughs> and not leaving anything out in between we got the Schubert's <laughs> so we've true. got the we got the 70s we've got I don't think she's asked for many things from the 20s or 30s, but then that's pretty well covered on this channel. Anyway, so we're going to do roulette. Thank you. Thank you. I have a problem that I cannot explain. I have no reason why it should have been so plain Have no questions but I sure have excuse I lack the reason why I should be so confused I know how I feel when I'm around you I don't know how I feel when I'm around you But it ain't a bit of use I have some pictures The wild might be the deuce Today you saw You saw me You explained Playing the show And running down the plane I know How I feel When I'm around you I don't know How I feel
never know what to do to like do you open it right up and be an opera singer or do you just keep down there well we decided to do both you can write in the description you can comment what you think about our interpretations Terrible. i our am covers. disgusted disgusted signed disgusted hopefully yours. you got Tunbridge ca Wells came for the system of a down stayed, stayed for, for the, the Shelton Island. Brooks oh right. yeah <laughs> yes. whatever stayed for the Kilburn song yeah okay great thanks so much that was so much fun thanks for all thank your requests thank you so much congratulations and if you do actually want Christmas check out the other, other three Christmas videos that we've got for living room requests well done Zena <laughs> because I wished I'd I'd studied the, the guitar you know honestly I could be so much help to him but no 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 the, the first lesson it was at school it, sh it took ages to show you how to play one E and I thought that's inefficient <laughs> I can do that on a piano just with one finger without all this nonsense how wrong how wrong so well done Zena you know everybody should learn the guitar see you later thanks for watching thank you <laughs>